Thanks for joining us today. I'm John with the Technical Support Team. Today's video is a short demonstration on installing field installable hose ends on our high pressure supply hose. This is a frequent question our tech service group assists with, so we figured a short video was in order. This procedure is the same for all our offered field installable hose ends. There are a couple different ways of installing these using wrenches or pliers. However, for the purpose of this video, I will demonstrate the proper procedure using a special hand vise tool created for this purpose. I would recommend using this tool as it may help reduce the chances of hand and wrist related injuries. I'm using one of our quarter inch hose studs, but the method is the same for both our SAE and metric hose ends. So let's begin. I'm going to do a little bit of setup here. Take your hand vise, attach the hose similar to this, or if you've got a longer set, at least an inch from where you are in a cut. Lock it into place. I'm also going to do the same thing with the stud itself. I'm going to lock it into a pair of locking wrenches. This is just to give you some added leverage. Next step is to take your hose cutters and make a nice clean cut on the end of that hose. Take your threaded sleeve and it is a left-handed thread threaded onto the end of the hose. For the next step, go ahead and actually take it off of the hand vise and flip it so that the hose threaded sleeve is locked in as so. Now, this is the reason why I locked it into this. You're going to press the tapered end of this throw hose stud into the end so it's going to widen the end of that hose at the same time you're trying to lock it into those threads. There we go. Now once you get to the end, once you feel them firm up like that, stop. You don't need to torque it any further or else you risk breaking off this stud. Go ahead and disconnect everything. You now have a hose end ready for use. I hope this helped with better understanding installation of the hose ends. If you have any questions, feel free to contact our technical support team at the information here. If you like these short videos, please let us know by hitting that like button. These are for you all in the field to help effectively and correctly install components to avoid failures. If there is something you would like to see from us, please let us know in the comments. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you on the next one.